Cheers to you, man. What a great fight. I want to know what was going on exactly in your head when you got that spine shot to the back and you were laying there in pain. How did you get up and continue in your fight? <laughs> in the start, I didn't. Uh, it took my brain, it took my air out, and I was afraid that there was a certain injury. But I could feel everything was good in my legs and stuff. And I'm here to fight. I'm not here to quit out. So I want to. I want to put on a fight for the fans. That's what I'm doing. I'm, I, as much as I do this for myself, I'm doing it to put a performance on. So the show must go on, and I, I have to continue fighting. No way I was gonna. Even if I was gonna win that way, I, I don't want to win that way. I'd rather lose a decision than win from from something like that. Do you feel pain now, or is it coming already to itself? I feel pain all over. I'm one big pain, but it is what it is. I'll see tomorrow. Right now, I'm gonna pop some morphine and yeah. and go and, and have a good time. But uh, yeah. You and Lima have been on each other's throats for months. Did this fight become something more than just a regular competition and became something personal? It's always personal for me because I got a family to provide for, and if I don't go in and win. I'm not getting all paid all, so of course he, he's trying to take a lot of uh, some of my money out. Uh, so it's very personal for me. It has to. I also I cannot go in and kill myself. So it has to be personal. When the fight is personal for you, how do you separate your feelings, both before the fight and during the fight? It just pumps me up. It makes me a better athlete. But in there, I'm calm and collected. I see everything. I hear everything. I just feel today he was one step ahead. And props to him and his camp. Uh, they they looked into something I've not been doing in a long time wrestling, because I've been fighting wrestlers. Um, but it is what it is. On to the next. When was the first moment that you felt that you are a step back behind Lima? When he got his hands raised. <laughs> okay, thank you. May I ask you, what are the plans for you? Are you planning on recollecting your belt and continuing maybe or trying to hit again maybe your longest second longest reign in octagon? Of course I'm going to get that bell. I know he's not invested in Octagon. I'm invested in Octagon. I'm, I'm planned to stay here. I'm planned to put on a show. The fans love me. I love the fans. And uh, yeah, if the money is good, I'm going to stay and, uh, and continue what I'm doing. But that bell is definitely going to come back to Denmark again, 100%. Cheers, mate. And how did you enjoy fighting in front of the crowd that clearly loved you? It was amazing. It's always amazing fighting Octagon. It's the first time I lose in, in front of Octagon fans in MMA, but I'm always enjoying it. But it would have been sweeter if I got home with the victory, of course. That's what we were focusing on. And what's the thing, thing that you are looking forward to most during your recovery? Just spend time with my son and my family. And yeah, uh, it's been two fights back to back. I wanted to stay busy. I wanted the fans to to get something. I, I, I got an opponent who pulled out, and uh, instead of saying oh, I'm going to wait out, I said let's let's take this guy. Um, so yeah, let's see. I'm going to take two weeks, maybe a month off. Not off. I'm still going to be training, but recovery and and getting back and and get it be get better. Okay, thank you very much. Cheers to you, man. Great fight. Thank you. I'm here with the new bantamweight champion. Yes. How do you feel? I feel amazing. I feel so happy and grateful for everything. Like uh, it's crazy uh, the feeling. I can't. I can't explain. <laughs> what are your plans for the future? Magard had just mentioned that Octagon is maybe not your target, and you would like to go somewhere else. Is that true, or are you planning on staying and defending your new title? I'll defend my belt for sure. I mean. Uh, I'm very grateful for the opportunity that the Octagon gave me and I'm looking forward for the next step with them. Okay, cheers man, thank you very much. Thank Have you. a nice day and enjoy you your belt. Too. Thank you very much.